Why, hello and welcome. Ignore the band-aid, I got a cut earlier. I'm all right though. So I have this fun thing I wanted all summer and then I finally got it yesterday. It is this Molly and Pops Japanese surprise snacks box. And I just really wanted to get it because they have cool snacks. So yeah, so we're gonna do that. And then I also have Ramen, I think. <laughs> and I had the melon type at Disney World, but I've never tried the original, so we're gonna try it. And then to start, I have this Botan rice candy. I love this. I get this every time I go there, even though it's kind of expensive. But I love it. Also, this whole video is gonna be like one shot, because like I'm just eating. So it's like this cute little packaging. I love it. And then, where is it? There it is. Aw. Every package comes with a free sticker. I put them on my suitcase. I love them. <laughs> it's a little mouse. Okay, so they look, they look like this. And then you unwrap them. But then, there's this little potato star trapper that you're supposed to leave on. Sorry, the sun is over there. This is potato star trap for you leave on. <laughs> it's really good. It's kind of like strawberry flavor a little. I was to say. Yeah, each candy has a edible wrapper that melts in your mouth. And then, let's try the Ramun. I don't know how to say that. I'm just gonna butcher it every time. <laughs> there we go. I'm just gonna put everything right there for now. Okay, so there's like a marble here that I gotta push in. I don't know how. Where's the instructions? Okay, so I use this to push the marble in. Did it! <laughs> oh, there's a mar the marbles in there! That's cool! <laughs> okay, I've never tried this before. Right there. <laughs> it was cool. I don't know how to describe this. I like it though. Bubblegum, that's what it's like. It's like bubblegum. It's very bubbly. try and put a lid back on it. Bam. There. The lid's on. And then I'm just gonna set it on the floor because I don't have a table to put it on. Alright, so now I'm gonna open this and I'm gonna have to stop editing and open it. So yeah. Okay, so here we are. Ignore my phone charging. First class Japan. Oh, there's tape. One second. I need to get my gun in France. Probably isn't smart because I'm not left handed. Here. There we go. Awesome. There we go. Awesome. I opened it. Whoa, that's really cool. Naruto sugar candy, ABC message cookies. My tripod keeps falling. What's this? Whoa, 
Um, I can't read that. <laughs> it's big though. And then this has got to be some sort of cola thing. Oh, there's little labels. Sour paper candy cola. It's just little things, like a mini bottle thing. My tripod is in. Yogurt flavor. I've never had yogurt. I'm a little scared. <laughs> and then there's like a bunch of little Kit Kats in here. They look. Oh, they're the cram cranberry almond ones. I almost picked up a pack of these. I'm glad I didn't because I don't want to have so many cranberry almonds. And these are chocolatey sublime. Oh, these are the ruby cocoa ones. I got one of these when I was in Europe, like the ruby cocoa. Milkita honeydew shake candy. Oh, this is cute. It's a little space panda. No, it's a space cow. I don't know what this is. Grape and clean. Grape and cream flavored lollipop. Big. Squishy. Oh, here it is. It is big marshmallow. More Kit Kats. More milk does. Like this. Pandoro. Butter cookie. Oh, there's this. This is something. I think it's ice cream flavor? Ice lolly, cocoa vanilla. And then the agris agrisuko roasted wasabi coated green peas and then snowflake cracker. All right, let's try these. Oh, I'm back. I never left. I should probably close my knife now. All right, so. We're gonna start with the smaller stuff. I'm a little hesitant to try this yogurt drink. I guess I'm gonna try this first because I don't wanna end on a bad note. So we're gonna get my original drink ready just in case. This one's a lot easier to open. And now I actually know how to open it. <laughs> oh, the lid came off with it. There we go. Oh wait, I have a trash bag right next to me. Why am I putting the plastic everywhere? <laughs> there. All plastic goes in the trash bag, which is just the Lolly and Pops bag. Oh yeah, I got all this from Lolly and Pops, if I didn't tell you guys earlier. <laughs> but I go there every time I go to the mall, just because they're so cool. And they give you free samples when you walk in. It's great. <laughs> Alright, any oh, there we go. There we go. Finally got it to work. I'm very nervous. <laughs> I'm not strong enough. <laughs> I have to like do this. <laughs> it's kind of freaky every time. Alright. I like the bottle design. I like this little marble. That's cool. <laughs> I'm too easily entertained. Alright. I have this one at the ready just in case I don't like this one. Is that what yogurt tastes like? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if I like that. This one is still super bubbly. I don't know if I like this one. Nope, I don't like it. I like my bubble gum. I do not like yogurt. Ugh. This is... Probably just because I don't really eat dairy products. Maybe. But like, if you like yogurt, go for it. But I don't eat yogurt, so... I'm gonna set them one far away so that I don't mix it up with my actual drink. <laughs> and then I've got 
my water because I don't want yogurt flavor in my mouth. Pro tip this school year, reusable water bottles. Get one, use them multiple times because less plastics. Oh my, I've seen people complain that like they can't have plastic water bottles, but like they make reusable plastic water bottles. Or just like, I have this one because I got it for free yesterday, but like just get one of these and fill it up in the water fountain. Simple as that, just use it more than once and you're good. <laughs> but yeah, he is going to be shown in a video coming up soon. Alright, so I don't know what to try next. Um, let's try, I guess we're trying this next, but first we're going to go with the almond cranberry Kit Kats. <laughs> I like almonds. I'm not too big a fan of cranberries. I feel like I'm with a majority of the US just only eating them at Thanksgiving. I've heard that people eat them at Christmas time too. Is that a thing? I don't know. I only eat them at Thanksgiving. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is what they look like. <laughs> I think they might have melted a bit in the car. But this is what <laughs> they look like. There's like little almond cranberry things. That's good. I like this. These are really good. <laughs> <laughs> Highly recommend. <laughs> um, next we're trying the Yokin Sour Paper Candy Cola. Oh, it's like, it's like one of those Airhead Extreme candies. <laughs> oh, that is sour. <laughs> but it tastes like cola. It doesn't taste like Coke. Bottle caps, like the, the Coke bottle cap. That's what it tastes like, but sour. Sour Coke tastes weird. Also, I'm sorry for the glare in my glasses. I would do this, but then you can't see my eyes. And I would take them off, but then I can't see. <laughs> it's just really good. <laughs> I'm gonna save some for later. That's good. I like that. 10 out of 10, we'll find again. I'm just remembering that like I did a f trying Asian candy video last year around the same time from the same store. <laughs> oh well. We're growing up. I've cut my hair. I'm gonna be a senior. I'm gonna film a video about being a senior. It is, I'm not ready. <laughs> oh well. We're growing up. I actually bought a box instead of just random candies that I had heard of before. It's so, like I had no clue what was in here. I can't even say most of what's in here. <laughs> That's the fun part. Alright, I already tried those Kit Kats. Um, let's try this thing. It's a mini bottle. It's got a little bird on it. Maruta mini bottle. May contain egg and crustacean. Why would there be crustacean in here? <laughs> I'm trying to find a flavor. I think the flavor is in Japanese. <laughs> All right, let's go. This is hard to open because okay there. That's a weird smell. Like I can smell it already. That does not smell normal. Okay. Like this. Children. Oh well. <laughs> okay. I don't know 
to do. So I put a bit of it on my hand. Donald, go. Right here. I don't know. It's like lime sugar. I like lime. <laughs> I like this. It's cool. It comes with like a little bottle. <gasps> it makes noise. <laughs> Probably the most easily entertained person ever. Give me candy and have it make noise. I'm set for a day. Okay. A little hesit hesitant about this one because I don't really like grape flavor. I know it's probably going to get me a lot of hate in the comments, but like, I don't like grape flavor. Or cherry flavor. Like, I like cherries. And grapes are okay. I don't eat them because spiders. But, like, I don't like grape or cherry flavor because like, it tastes like medicine. It's all spiraled. Ugh. Mm, it tastes like grape and the yogurt soda. <laughs> I did not like the yogurt. <laughs> I don't like that. I don't like that. <laughs> okay. Um, I have these rose Kit Kats. I gotta distinguish what I have and haven't tried yet. Okay, awesome. Oh, the box is like a little fish with candy. Oh. It's so cute. Okay, so the rose Coke Kit Kat. Hoping to make that my thumbnail. This is gonna be a long video. Oh well. I'm gonna put out 30 minutes. Okay, yeah, all these melted. I'm gonna put out 30 minutes of content a week. It's just me trying candy. know this flavor. I know this flavor. Those strawberry wafers, like the wafer crackers that are strawberry flavored, it's like that. There's, but it's chocolate. It's really good. <laughs> okay, I'll try this big thing. New. Ooh. Furuto Dodeca Bargo Choco Choco. It's a chocolate cracker. I'm not good at opening packages. Oh, this is big. Oh, there's two. Nope, it just broke. rind on the inside. That's a little weird. I'm gonna put that piece back because I'm not eating <laughs> all of the candy in one sitting. I'm just trying. So that's going over there and let's try a little piece. This is not a little piece. It's a huge bar. I'm very confused. Oh I got chocolate on my bed. <laughs> I'm a mess. I probably shouldn't be eating chocolate in a white shirt either knowing me. Oh well. This is more like the wafers of the last one. Those ones taste like the wafer, but these are basically wafers, but covered in chocolate. I love it. <laughs> That's good. There's a lot of cocoa in them. They're strong. Mm. All right. Butter cookie. It says butter cookie here. But on the back of the packaging, it says wheat cracker. So I don't know. I'm sorry, little panda boy. Oh, it broke. It was supposed to be panda shaped. Mmm. It's a butter cookie. I love butter cookies. They're good. Cause like they're so simple. 
And you can spice it up with like herbs or spices or like little flavorings. Butter cookies are so good. I could stuck in your teeth easily. It's good though. Okay. Big. <laughs> okay, so this is apparently a marshmallow. <laughs> oh, it's fluffy. This kind of looks like an egg. I'm scared that when I bite into it, there's going to be yellow. This is just a big marshmallow. <laughs> it's just a big marshmallow. I like it though. I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat all this. <laughs> Sam, Sam, you want marshmallow? No. He prefers fruit. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> nice marshmallow, nice little palate cleanser. <laughs> okay, now we have this ice lolly. So like, popsicle? But aren't they supposed to be frozen? It's like a Tootsie Pop, but like only the inside. I like it. That's good. Um, then we have ABC message cookies. Finally. J. Just a cookie. Is there an M? Yes. Or that's a W. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, that's, that tastes just like the butter cookie. But one's panda shaped and one shaped like letters. And again, it gets stuck in your teeth real easily. Okay, so there's five more things to try. Two of them are these little shake candies. One's honeydew, one's strawberry. They're hard candies. Mmm. Interesting. I don't know how to feel about that one. I love honeydew flavor, but it's not honeydew flavor. It's something else. Also, ignore my brother playing Fortnite in the background. I don't know how we got into Fortnite. Minecraft's better. <laughs> I miss. I don't know how to feel about the strawberry one either. They're both weird. All right, so now we have the big bags. <laughs> Alright, so I think we're gonna go with the roasted wasabi coated green peas, because I don't like peas, that's just me, but I also don't know how I feel about wasabi, I've never had it before. I know like they have wasabi with sushi, but like I don't eat sushi. I just have like this huge stigma against like raw fish, and did I already put my knife up because I need it, I need it, open this, here we go.
I've seen my friends eat these before. Hot, hot, ah, mm. <laughs> that's hot. Oh my god, that's hot. sugar candy. Naruto Ren. I don't know if you can see Naruto Ren. <laughs> okay. So I think these are it's just like rock candy, I think. Or it's just lumps of sugar, which I've gotten before. It's good. I got it from Hawaii. There we go. I hit myself in the face. Starburst. Yeah, that's just pure sugar. <laughs> yeah. Ingredients. Sugar, blue food coloring. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> Give these to your kids. I'm sure they'll love them. Give your kids pure sugar. Michaela approves. Okay. The snowflake cracker. I love this packaging. <laughs> it's so cute. <laughs> okay. This is loud. I can't open it. Oh wait, there's a little tab over here that I'm supposed to pull. That was so much easier. Oh whoa. Okay, so it's like it's a bunch of individually packaged crackers. That's cool. A lot of plastic though. Again, I can't open packages correctly. All right. I want to know why they're called snowflake. I also want to know why I can't open packages. reading the ingredients jasmine rice palm oil tapioca starch plutonious rice flour sugar salt and fish gelatin i like them though you can definitely kind of taste the fish gelatin though <laughs> but they're not bad It's just kind of like a fishy, vanilla-y rice cake. Also kind of salty. I don't know if that's from the salt or the fish. Alright. I should probably stop eating. <laughs> Alright, so that's the... That was the last thing. Tried all the candies. Some of them were better than others. I would definitely put my lowest rated item as the um, either the grape pop or the yogurt soda because I just don't like them. And then the best one would probably have to be um, the giant chocolate cracker. I like that. <laughs> this new something in Japanese. This was my favorite by far. I like it. It was really good. Would I pay $30 for this again? Yes, I would. <laughs> but that's just me. Because I like snacks and trying new things and like foreign food is so good. Like when I went to Europe, oh my god, the food there was amazing. <laughs> and like Japan is known for its snacks. 
like vending machine culture and all that. I'm glad I got to try some. I will definitely be taking these to school with me next week. If I, I'm hoping some are left. I don't plan on eating this whole thing in a week, but I might. Oh well. All right, so thank you all for watching. This video was not sponsored by Lolly and Pops, but like, if you want me to sponsor you, I'll so do it. No, if you want to sponsor me, I'll so do it because like I, I love the store. It's great. Y'all should go. And like, look at this cute little like suitcase design. It's like a suitcase design. It's, it's so cute and has like stickers. It's got like I heart sushi, which I don't, and then like Mount Fuji and like a little dinosaur. It's so cool. I'm gonna start my water bottle. All right, but yeah. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoy watching 30 minutes of just me eating food. But like, I guess it's kind of popular now with like mukbangs, whatever they're called. Mukbang, whatever. <laughs> I guess those are popular now, but like, I'm not popular <laughs> enough to do those. But like, oh well. Alright, I had fun. I'm gonna try and start posting weekly. I know I probably said that <laughs> a few times, but I'm actually gonna try this time. So yeah. Alright, thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Go give Lolly and Pop some love. They do free samples when you're walking around. Like, they'll give you a gummy bear and they're so good. I always go in and get like a half pound bag of just banana jelly beans because I love those. Alright, I need to stop talking about candy. <laughs> Alright. Bye guys.